was like a wonderful book club so to get all the topics into one place we need to put action right so i'm going to talk about this uh, from this book the magic of thinking big uh, how to get a create an action habit so what i'll do is i'll just take two case studies and then later we'll compare these two case studies okay so uh, with a slide show uh, so this there was this guy mr uh, p okay in uh, chicago and uh, he was unmarried in his late 30s okay so why he was unmarried let us let us see so he was actually uh, seeing lot of girls and one was close to marriage also but just one day before uh, the, it didn't work out so finally after seeing other set of girls like he finally go, uh, got to see one and he was like okay uh, i think this, she is the one uh, whom i am going to marry then everything was said then after like 4 uh, 5 days he came up with some five page of document what is the document about what she is going to be how i am going to see her how we are going to spend time how we are going to spend weekdays how we are going to spend weekends how much uh, time we are going to invest how much money we are going to invest how what habits she is going to break what habits she is going to acquire newly so it was like five page document okay and he sent it to her after sending she was like okay bye bye thank you <laughs> okay so then he was like oh, marriage is a big thing we need to be very careful right i we agree that yeah marriage is a big thing we need to be careful but you can't be that careful right so so many times what the what the author tells in the book the test of a successful person is not to eliminate all the problems at the first not like that oh, eliminate whatever is possible and then move on when the problems come then we can tackle it that's how we have to do this is about mr p then the second case study is about mr a mr a is married and he has a wife has a kid and is living in a nice uh, 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 rented apartment and uh, they always wanted to buy like uh, make one new home for themselves okay but this day one uh, one day what happened this mr a was writing a check uh, for rent and he is realized i can rather pay, pay this to a bank right so finally he decides and he goes to his wife and tells next week we are going to buy a home and his wife will be like crazy what happened to you all of a sudden next week we are buying a home uh, he was like yeah i have decided next week we are going we're going to buy i don't know how don't ask me how okay so next week he uh, uh, like it actually does happen like by next week he finds a home near a neighborhood but the catch is he has to pay 100 dollars down payment but but he will not have that much money because his income is very modest then he realizes okay let me let me decide uh, one thing uh, so actually he could have bought it from a friend but uh, he didn't want it to go on credit so that it will not it will affect mortgage or something like that so what he does he goes to his boss Yeah, actually, he, he before going to his boss, he will uh, make a uh, uh, agreement with the builder. I will give twelve hundred dollars, split it into a year, hundred dollars every every month with interest. The builder agrees. Then he will cut twenty five dollars expenses from his uh, monthly expense. Still seventy five dollars is left, right? So he will go to a boss and make a deal. Boss, uh, you see, you will give me hike whenever you desire. This uh, like you think I am, I deserve it. So what I do, I see some work which is uh, possible to be done in the weekend. so the, his boss appreciates his sincerity and ambition and then he tells okay i'll give the 75 dollar you can work 10 hours in the weekend so uh, by doing this he will uh, find this dream home and he will actually make it his own home uh, its own home okay so thing is he actually took a strong decision he realized it and then this decision gave him new confidence and uh, to uh, and this decision and this confidence made him to realize like uh, see some new opportunities okay so just now what to uh, compare and end it i just uh, share my screen and i hope you are able to see the screen so we'll just quickly see what was the difference okay so mr a takes action okay get things done mr p postpone doing things until he has proved he shouldn't or can't do them okay so uh, mr a follows through on ideas and plans he is a doer okay mr p he is a donter okay again a plans vacation takes it Mr. P, push me to until next year. Okay, this was some examples between activationists and passivationists. Okay, drops a note to someone he knows to congratulate him on some achievement. Who is doing activationists? What passivationists does? Finds a good reason to put off writing it, and it never gets written. Okay, so what Mr. A wants to go into business for himself, he does. Mr. P, he discovers just in the nick of time a good reason why he had better not. Okay. so mr a again get things done that he wants mr p he doesn't get things that uh, because he won't act okay so mr a as a by product of all this he gains confidence a feeling of inner security and more income obviously but mr p by by he loses confidence he destroys his self reliance and lives in mediocrity okay so we know every day thousands of people bury good ideas because they are afraid to act on them okay and afterward the ghosts of the uh, those ideas come back to haunt them right 
so uh, uh, we know like so many things we i have done before also so if we know it is but we don't act guys uh, it will be like a psychological pain but if we really act it will give mental satisfaction to us and uh, if we have fear acting cures fear without action there is the fear will not go so uh, this is like more of a problem statement what i told uh, next week i'll cover about how we can develop the habits of action and cure it with my real life example so yeah this is what i wanted to share thank you so much superb both of you are you both of you complement your topics beautifully in fact <laughs> another very nicely presented karthik uh, get the act action habit beautifully covered i really loved it the presentation and then sharing two stories and then comparing and then coming to conclusion and also keeping an audience intact with curiosity when is the bahubali part 2 coming please tell us <laughs> so next week people have to come to listen this amazingly you know ended as well karthik great